What's good, guys? We back at it again with another video. I know y'all probably like, why does he have this song? He don't go there. He doesn't hoop anymore. I got about two things, but I got to say before we even say what the surprise is for you guys today. First and foremost, y'all know we still we still do look like this, you know what I'm saying, even when we don't hoop. Secondly, for everybody who said they want to be tall, I just want y'all to see this. You see how close I am? I literally hit my head on that three times a day, and when it's moving, all I'm going to say is real pain, real pain. But the surprise is today, FGCU is actually playing USC. I think they're currently ranked number 25 in the country. So I'm actually going to tell you guys today, all my OGs, I know y'all remember the vlogs I did a couple months ago. I had to stop because I've been extremely busy. But we back at it today. Should be fun. I'm going to take you guys throughout my entire day. Whatever I do, I might even get a little, some practice film from, from the prep. If they hooping today, you know, sometimes they be trying them, whatever. But we going to see. Let's go. All right, guys. So I just got to the facilities and dropped the kids off. Forgot to show you guys. This is my little baby during the week. But I'll be driving the kids around in. You know, I got to still be a very safe driver, especially when I have driving around this many people. I didn't really think about it from the other side when I was a player. But, uh, yeah, we just uh, dropped them off. We're headed into film right now. You know, at the prep, we try and do everything as close as we can to college. Obviously, it's not, but you still want to. How you doing? Obviously, it's not, but you still want to, you know, try and manufacture that college experience so, it so that when they do get there, it's an easy transition. Um, this weather out here is crazy nice. It actually smells like Georgia. It smells like getting out of practice in high school at 6 o'clock. I swear I remember that vividly smelling exactly like this but I might show you guys a little bit of film see what we got today Let's see all right guys so we have practice right now i'm not actually gonna be able to record during practice of course can't show you guys what plays we'll be running of course you know just in case the opposition trying to scout us let y'all see a little bit you see us on the uniforms can't show them too much these kids be they trying to get a little funny on camera can't be doing too much but uh see you guys later All right, so we just got done with practice. Uh, remember what I always tell you guys, though, make sure you're trying to get 1% better every single day. That's something we always try to teach our kids. But usually after practice, depending on what day it is, we do have a game tomorrow. But most days we do like to you know, let them get some type of recovery in. So we let them come to the pool, show you guys what that looks like. Uh, Real OGs remember the palm tree that I showed in my first vlog when I first got here. It was kind of crazy, but as you can see, got a little bit of a fit change. Got the family tee on, obviously. Uh, what is it? Once an ego, always an ego. Y'all already know. Slight, slight feast, just some ones. Y'all already know. I don't know if y'all actually ain't even going to get into my shoe size because I hate people talking about it already. But <clears throat> about to go up here today. Like I said, they are playing USC. Hopefully it's a good game, you know. Um, I know we have gotten some some new transfers onto the squad at FGCU, so I'm excited to see how they mesh, how they gel, and it's going to be a packed out crowd. Probably barely going to be any room, so it's going to be extremely exciting. That popcorn will be popping, so we're going to see who came to play, who's ready to play, show out in front of the fans. I'm about to go meet my boy, and then we're going to drive up there, so I'll probably see you guys on the ride. Okay, guys, so we made it out here on the campus. Got my guy Dolan with me. One of my old teammates. I want to show you guys a little bit why I actually ended up committing the Gulf Coast. This is actually on campus. This entire view, this entire beach right here, whole boardwalk, things like that. Like that's why I say I look you miss it from time to time. But just being out here, seeing this, about to go see these this game right here. Hopefully these guys can put on a show out here for the fans. Make me a proud a uh, proud eagle. See you guys in there.
I recorded a USC move, but not the other way around. Hey guys, so I'm outside it's PDQ as you can see. Got myself a little strawberry shake, but obviously we didn't get the win tonight. I mean that sucks, but I feel like you know the team gave a great effort for most of the game. It was actually extremely close. I think you know at the end of the first half it was literally within five points. So it was literally just a, a quick stretch. Literally towards the end of the first half they kind of pulled away a little bit, and then second half they made a couple threes and we missed some threes, missed some shots, things like that. But you know, it was a still big time game to just experience and just to see a Lico Arena just that popping, you know, that exciting, just having that many people in there, seeing just that energy. You know, that was just great to see, especially, you know, since I that was actually my first time being back in the arena since the last time I played there. Like, you know, I've been back in the Fort Myers area, but never back actually in Alico. So I was big time, you know, Boogie Ellis was playing. Like, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys probably know Boogie. He had about 20, I think like 20 and seven. He was hooping out there, really showing off. Uh, Isaiah Mobley, Evan Mobley's brother, was also played pretty well. But I do want to give a shout out to uh, my guy Cyrus on FGCU, right? So I do want to say, like, Cyrus is like the epitome for a lot of you guys who you have the dream of walking on to a college and then at some point becoming a scholarship player. Cyrus Largi, I'm talking about my freshman year. This kid, or no, not, not my freshman year, my junior year, his freshman year. This kid, he shows up. Nobody really knows who he is. Okay, we have a new walk on on the team. You know, and this kid won every single sprint, competed day in, day out, in practice every single day. You know, at a certain point, we started to look like, okay, wait, this kid can kind of play. He got an opportunity. All of a sudden, he took advantage of it. When he got in the game, next thing you know, he's starting. By the end of that year, last year, he had a solid year. And tonight, he had 20-6 and six against USC. So imagine going from a walk-on without having a scholarship to having 20 points, six rebounds, against a power five that has five stars, future probably NBA draft picks on that team. So just imagine that. So this is why I tell you guys, you always have to try and get 1% better every single day. Like, I don't care, you know what I'm saying? If you feel tired, if you're lazy, you're still trying to get better every single day. Every single time you step on the court, you're trying to achieve something, you gotta, you're trying to reach your dreams. But, you know, this was a good day. Great to have you guys with me. It was nice to do a little vlog today, but like, share, subscribe. It's on the post notifications, pre as you guys watch. Remember, if you want the subscriber breakdowns, you know what I'm saying? That go on the channel, one-on-one -on -one instruction, how you can improve your game. Hit my website, Patreon, for the day-to-day -day, um, story times, things like that. Like I said, appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you guys next time with the next video.